Hello, everyone. I'm Nadine Les with Berkshire Hathaway, and today I'm talking to my friend and client, Sari Papazian, who has created the, with the, his partner a new company specific for eliminating and disinfecting spaces that uh, were affected by vir the virus. Uh, with the business opening on Friday, I think it's a very interesting subject. I let Sari introduce himself and tell you a little bit about this business. Hi, Sari. Hey, hey guys, how's everyone doing? Hey, Nadine, thank you so much for um, for this whole idea and this introduction. I appreciate you as always. Um, so basically, what um, me and my partner started doing, we we have a completely different background. One, you know, his background is in cars, my background is in clothing. But uh, when when this whole um, pandemic started, you know, we just saw a, a big void, basically one to help out our community with um, disinfection and otherwise just basically to be able to um, hire some people, uh, create some jobs and at the same time, of course, and everyone knows, be able to make some money in this business. Um, what we do and what we only do is we basically do virus disinfection. To be clear, we are not a cleaning company. We are not a carpet company that does disinfection. We are a virus disinfection company. And the only thing that we do is virus disinfection. Uh, we are uh, licensed and certified. When I say licensed and certified, just to be very clear to everybody, um, there is no virus disinfection certification or licensing. But you can get a lot of other licenses and certifications that help in this domain. So you can get, for example, a bloodborne pathogen certification. You can get PPE certification, certain things like that. Um, all of our technicians are, are experienced. Um, and our main purpose, again, like I said, is to disinfect viruses. So if people have uh, positive coronavirus cases, um, they could go ahead and call us. And that's what we've been called upon a lot lately. We go into spaces um, and disinfect the, the residents from the virus. Um, right now, since everything is about to open up again, we're getting a lot of calls from businesses, even if there's no positive coronavirus case. But what they're doing is they actually just want to be preemptive, basically. And it's a lot of preventative disinfecting. So we'll go in there once a week or once every two weeks, depending on the business and the foot traffic, and we'll disinfect. The, vi the, excuse me, the chemicals that we use are EPA certified um, and also CDA, uh, CDC approved. And those chemicals, they actually coat the layers that we're, we're, we're fogging on. So it will kill viruses that are there now, but they will also continue to kill that virus for a week from today. And a week, of course, depending on foot traffic, could be 10 days, could be five days. Um, it's helping a lot of, it's actually, we think it's gonna be helping a lot of businesses where they keep their customers' um, mind at ease. You know, if your competition is disinfecting, you've gotta be doing the same thing. And if they're not, you're gonna be able to get advantage over them. Sorry, okay. I'm, I went on a long roll over there. No, but, no, that's um, great. So. Yeah. Um, so, you know, and that in real estate, in my business, we are still showing houses and we are wearing gloves and booties and masks. Uh, but I, for people who bought a house and want to move in it, I think it's very important for them to disinfect the house prior to moving in. So I have two questions for you. The first question is, how long does the process take to disinfect a property? And the second question is, how do you price it? Okay. Um, well, we can ask my partner in crime. Over here. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> that's my that's my partner in crime right now. Um, so, <laughs> what, um, so what? So what we get, what we do is this. So one, there, there's there's two ways to approach this. One, if there's a, um, you're suspecting a case, or if, or there is a positive case, or is just for um, uh, to be preventive. Peace of mind. Exactly. So for the peace of mind approach, the one that you're thinking about, um, it depends on the space. It could be anywhere between one to three hours if we're talking residents. So if we're talking a 6,000 square foot home, that's going to take about three hours. If we're talking about a thousand square foot home, that's going to take about an hour. Um, the process that we do is we enter the space. Uh, excuse no, me, I, I, need, I, need my, I need my headphones. I'm, I know, but I need my headphones. Sorry. So um, the, the process that we basically do is we go in there, a team of two or three, depending on the space, and we use um, foggers and we spray the entire home. The fogging 
when we spray it, it doesn't get anything wet. It's a, it, it creates a very small, um, it breaks down the, the chemical into small particles, and then we're, it's able to penetrate the entire home. After that, we go ahead and we wipe down all high contact surfaces. And then when we're done with that, we go ahead and we fog again. Uh, pricing depends. If it's a one-time thing, it could be anywhere between 149 to 499 for residents. And then if it's something that's reoccurring, it could be, well, it, it really depends on how, how often it is and what big the space is. Okay. Um, yeah. So for example, for commercial spaces, we can do anywhere between 10 cents a square foot going up to 35 cents a square foot okay. for one time. And if it's reoccurring, you know, there, it's flexible from there. Okay. And then what kind of businesses have you been able to disinfect so far? Oh, so, 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 so far we've been, uh, we've been doing, um, it's okay, Mia, just keep playing here. I'll be with you in a minute. I'm so sorry, Nadine. It's okay. I'm disinfecting so far car dealerships, uh, grocery stores. Those are our two main ones so far. So we've been approached by two grocery stores that have signed with us for a year contract. Car wow. dealerships have been a big thing for us because they've been open, they've been considered an essential business. And the only way they could get their customers in is to make sure that they're Absolutely. being tested. Yep, we've uh, we've done a couple of clinics. One has been a one-time thing, and the other clinic has signed with us for six months. One is testosterone clinic. That's um, great. Yeah, yeah, it's it's really like we've started this whole operation maybe three weeks ago, and we we're very happy with the results so far. We've uh, we've had multiple, um, probably a couple dozen uh, coronavirus cases, positive cases that we've had to go in and disinfect because um, it's been there's been a positive case over there. Uh, that's a different approach. So that process takes a lot more than one or two hours because okay. we will wipe down every single point, not only high contact surfaces, but we will do even the low contact surfaces, the floor, everything that your hands can reach, we have to disinfect those. Okay. So that process takes between two to eight hours, okay. depending on the space as well. Um, I don't know. That's about it. And then, so if somebody wants to get in touch with you, wants to look at your service, uh, wants to get more information. What's the what? How would you like them to contact you? Okay. Would, would it be so, better by email, by phone, by Instagram, by Facebook, by LinkedIn? What's the best way to reach? <clears throat> so there is no best way. Everything everything works with us. Um, you know, we have a staff that's ready to 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 pick up. You know, the calls, give you all the information, everything that you need. Now, because this. Um, meaning that this uh, Zoom meeting that we're doing me and you is going to personally, your personal uh, clientele and your knowledge. So reaching my phone is perfectly fine. You know, I would love to know that they came through you. That would be great. Um, and uh, they could just call me directly. Our website is virusbustersga.com. Um, yes. So it's vi yeah, virusbustersga.com. And um, I'll share the number with you as well so that you can uh, post with this to someone to reach Perfect. us. Sadi, thank you so much for no, your I mean, time. Thank you, Nadine. Of course. Of I course, hope. Of course. I think it's a brilliant idea. I think it's a brilliant idea. I think I'm going to be your first customer. I'm going to oh. disinfect <laughs> all the house I have on the market. Thank you so much. Best of luck you, to Nadine. you. And I know that I will be in touch. Oh, thank you so much, Nadine. Thank you, everybody. Thank you.